A fun event for the month of February is highlighting food of South America. Funky's Catering is hosting a five course February wine dinner on Friday, February 17th, and every course focuses on South American flavors. Joining me this morning is Michael Forgus with Funky's Catering. Thanks for coming for in, Michael. I, my pleasure, my pleasure. You've brought a, the South America thing really throwing me off. It's really exciting. Tell right. us what you brought in, what you're making. So um, the, the dinner that we try to do with the wine dinners, we try to do some things that are slam dunk, you know, pairings with wine and food that go but then we also really try to stretch people's palates this is what this is all about so the south american dinner um what i'm going to demo today is a peruvian style ceviche so we have a little dish here that we're starting that's got fluke and shrimp and cilantro and jalapenos and onions and then i'm just going to take a little of the um octopus octopus yeah so i'm just going to take that and mix that in I don't do a lot of octopus. Is it a strong flavor? No. Is it going to be not, one that you want to? No, okay. it's, it's, it, octopus is all about how well you cook it. Okay. If, if you cook octopus properly, it's got a great flavor, so I'm going to add that in. Okay. And then I've got a little of the, the brining mixture that you come and you just mix in, and this is clam juice and lime juice wow. and just a little seasoning, and that's mixed, and then just, just a little salt and pepper, because uh -huh. that's part of because it, it, ceviche is what happens is it, it, it's cooked as it's cured, and so okay. this, is, this becomes the entire cure. So you mix this around and let this sit. I don't know, eight, nine, ten mm -hmm. minutes, and then you strain it. And so once it's all strained, it looks like there you go. You know, modern technology. <laughs> and there's a little strain, and that's when it's all finished. Wow. And then there's a bachochos in the which is the fresh corn that goes in. Okay. And then it's going into a twill, uh, a sesame twill, and that just gets mixed in. These are one of these dishes that you get served and you think, how did they make that? <laughs> and right. you're, you're showing us really the, right, the insides right. here. This right. is amazing. And then we take a little, these are sea beans. No, so these, these from are, South America. No, these are actually Mediterranean. Mediterranean. These are Mediterranean, okay. but really, they're in, they're, they taste just, really good. they're just in season now. Yeah, they're and so Really? One of the things that we try to do Playful. with all the dinners we have is what we call it, uh, foods that are in bloom. Okay. So foods that are in bloom in that season. And then we have a dehydrator. And so what we do is we take tomatoes. And so this is a little tomato powder that we have that's been dehydrated tomato powder and just to get make because people eat with their eyes first you want everything looking nice well people come and do your right. dining experience uh, right are they seeing a little bit of how it's made and get a little bit yes, more they of it one of the things that we try to do with the wine dinner is sort of like the iron chef yeah. so the hors d'oeuvres you start in the kitchen you go up people are making the hors d'oeuvres you try it you have the wine you're tasting what it is and what so you can actually see it being created plus the chef gets to tell you why they're doing what they do yeah. and where the product comes from well this is and fantastic so that's what we try to do yeah. and then we're also in, in mixing in some very interesting wines. Um, this wine in particular is a very unique blend and you can see it's called Ig O and that is um, it was the concept was started in um, Europe but it's gotten very popular and the Michelini brothers that own um, Zorzal have really been growing with it and what it is it's a concrete fermenter that's all um, made shape of an egg. Oh. And so when the fermentation that's, goes yeah. as the wine is fermenting it's like an, almost like a botanage a con continual botanage so right. usually when wine ferments the heat starts getting up and you have to punch down the wine you don't have to do that because it stays contained wow. in the shell and it brings a real creaminess and smoothness plus it keeps man out of nature's process so it helps keeps man out of nature's process. Well, thank you so much for coming in for all the demonstrations and the examples there for the wine. We really appreciate it. it sounds like a fantastic evening. Right. If you'd like to take part, Funky's Catering Event is featuring the South American food for this February's wine dinner. It takes place at the Transept on fe Friday, February 17th at 6.30. For tickets or more information, head to funkyscatering.com. Thanks so much right. for coming in. Thank you, Jennifer. My pleasure.